Hey everyone, here's a question on HCF. The question is, find the HCF of 30 and 42. HCF is nothing but highest common factor, where you have to find out the common factor which is highest, okay, which can divide both 30 and 42. So there are two methods, one is division method, one is a prime factorization method. In this video, I'm going to show you both the methods, that is a prime factorization and a division method, right? So let's see so first i'm going to go with the prime factorization method in this method you're going to fa prime factorize both the numbers separately and then you're going to take the common factors out of it right so let's prime factorize 30 so prime factorize i'm saying you should take only prime numbers fine so we have here a 2 2 15 size 30 right again we have 15 doesn't go in two table i'm going to take 3 as the next prime number 3 5 is a 15 we have 5 5 is a prime number so 5 ones are 5 Next, 42. 42 is an even number. I'm going to start with 2. 2 twos are 4. 2 ones are 2. Now, 21 doesn't go in 2 tables. So I'm going to take 3. 3 sevens are 21. Now, 7 is a prime number. It goes only in 7 tables. So, 7 ones are 7. So, once you have done this, you should write down the prime factors of each number separately. So, 30 is equal to, write down all these factors. It's 2 into 3 into 5. Similarly, 42 is equal to, write down all these factors. 2 into 3 into 7, 2 into 3 into 7. So once you have done this, you have to f t f uh, like take out the f common factor which are present in both 30 and 42. Right? If you observe here, we have a 2 which is present in both. right? And we have this 3 which is present in both. Now for this 5, we don't have a uh, like a 5 a factor in 42 and for this 7 also we don't have a factor here so this 2 will be like we're not getting pay for 5 and 7 so leave it like that so the one which you got a pair like for 2 we got a pair for 3 also we got a pair they're present in both the numbers you have to multiply them so just take one one number from this pair I'll going to take 1 2 and from this pair I'm going to take 1 3 multiply this 2 will get 6 so 6 will be the highest common factor of 30 and 42 now this is prime factorization method i'm going to show you by division method the same you're going to get it now division method is similar to the normal division but it uh, the method changes like in the second step like from second step onwards so from this 30 and 42 we have to choose a divisor and dividend. So divisor will be the number which is the smallest. So 30 smaller here has compared to 42. So 30 will be the divisor. So divisor means we're going to divide that number with. And 42 is a greater here. So 42 will become dividend. So this number we're dividing it. Okay, We're dividing 42 by 30. Now you just do a normal division. So 30 ones are 30. Subtract it. We'll get here 12. Now from here, from second step, uh, it will change. It's not like normal division now. Here, 12 will become the divisor for the second step. And what will be the dividend? Your dividend is nothing but in the previous step, what was your divisor? This number will become dividend for the second step. So here it will be. So 30 will come here as a dividend and the remainder what we got here in the first step that will become divisor. Remember the divisor will become the first divisor will become dividend here and whatever remainder we got that will be the divisor. Now you just do the normal division. So 12 2 is a 24. Normal division how you do just do it. So the remainder will be 6 right. Now again we have to keep on doing till you get the remainder 0. So again you have to do divide this. So 6 will become the divisor. So what will be the dividend? Dividend will be the divisor of previous step. In the previous step 12 was a divisor. So that will become divid na dividend now. So 12 will come here. Now divide this normally like how we do. So 6 2 is a 12. Subtract it we got the remainder 0. So you can stop here. So we got 0 but what is the HCF? In the last step whatever was a divisor. So here 6 is a divisor right. So 6 will be the HCF. So you have to keep on doing it till you get 0. In the last step whatever is a divisor that will be the HCF. So here HCF will be. So therefore HCF of 30 and 42 is equal to 6. So I hope this question is clear how to find out the HCF using both prime factorization and the division method. In case you have further question or doubt, you can leave a comment. Thank you so much for watching.